Penn State hosted Robert Morris in a non-conference matchup for the third consecutive season. The Nittany Lions outscored Robert Morris 14-6 in the two previous years, but on Friday night, the Colonials kept the game tied at 1-1 heading into the third period. The second was poor. We had 17 shots, but when you give up five odd man rushes, like that's not worth it. Um, so we have, we definitely have work to do. Penn State freshman Connor McEckern scored two minutes into the second period to make it one nothing. But the Colonials answered with four minutes left to go in the second. As the Penn State crowd grew restless, senior captain Brandon Byro delivered the game-winning goal halfway through the third period putting him in some rare company. Brandon Byro's go-ahead goal in the third period gave him 100 points for his career. He became the fifth Nittany Lion ever to achieve that feat. That was definitely the beneficiary of a great play. I was just kind of standing there, so uh, it, was, it was really good to see that, you know, what we worked on all week and what we harped all week really paid off. Penn State was the highest scoring team in the Big Ten last season, but even with eight of their top ten scorers returning this year, the Nittany Lions scored just two goals in their final two games of non-conference play. We're searching a little bit. It's not flowing for us yet, and uh, we have some work to do. Godowski is pleased with the defensive improvement this year, but he wants to see his team sacrifice less offense. In University Park, I'm Will Desitel for the Center County Report. We hope you enjoyed watching the video. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel if you did. For the rest of our newscasts and featured stories, click here. And for sports, click here. Have a great day, and thanks for watching.